Good day to one and all. We will be discussing the solutions for questions in page number 10 and 12. And the PDF for notes is given in the description box. Do download it. Do like and share this video and do subscribe to my channel. And the PDF for notes is given in the description box. And join the Telegram channel for more updates. So let's start with the second question. Look at these triangles made with dots. How many dots are there in each? Compute the number of dots needed to make the next three triangles. So number of dots in the first triangle is equal to 1 plus 2 which is equal to 3. If you observe the first triangle, the number of dots is equal to 1 plus 2. Same in the case of second triangle, number of dots in the second triangle is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3, which is equal to 3 plus 3, which is equal to 6. 1 plus 2 plus 3 and in the case of third triangle 1 plus 2 plus 3 and plus 4 now we have to compute the number of dots needed to make the next three triangles so the number of dots required in every triangle is just got by adding the natural numbers in the first triangle 1 plus 2 in the second triangle, 1 plus 2 plus 3. In the third triangle, 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4. And the same way, we have to add one more natural number to the fourth triangle. That is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5. Number of dots in the third triangle is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 which is given here which is equal to 6 plus 4 which is equal to 10. Number of dots in the fourth triangle is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 and add one more natural number that is the next natural number plus 5. That is equal to 10 plus 5, which is equal to 15. And in the same case for fifth triangle, we have to add one more natural number after 5, that is 6. So number of dots in the fifth triangle is equal to 1 plus, 2 plus, 3 plus, 4 plus. 5 plus 6 which is equal to 15 plus 6 which is equal to 21. Now for number of dots in 6 triangle will be 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7. So the number of dots In the sixth triangle is equal to 1 plus, 2 plus, 3 plus, 4 plus, 5 plus, 6 plus 7, which is equal to 21 plus 7, which is equal to 28. Here's the third question. Write down the sequence of natural numbers, leaving remainder 1 on division by 3. And the sequence of natural numbers leaving remainder 2 on division by 3. First of all, let us divide natural numbers by 3. Natural numbers are nothing but 1, 2, 3 and so on. 1 by 3, 2 by 3, 3 by 3, 4 by 3, 5 by 3, 6 by 3. 7 by 3, 8 by 3, 
9 by 3 and 10 by 3. Now, if we divide 1 by 3, 3 zeros are 0, 1. If we divide 2 by 3, 3 zeros are 0, 2. So, the remainder in first case is 1 and the remainder in second case is 2. And 3 by 3 is nothing but 1. It has the remainder as 0. 3 by 3, 1 is 3, 0. So, the remainder is 0. R is equal to 0. In the case 4 divided by 3, 3 ones are 3, 1. So, the remainder is 1. In the case 5 divided by 3, 1s are 3, 2. The remainder is 2. If you divide 6 by 3, 3, 2s are 6, 0. Remainder is 0. If you divide 7 by 3, 2s are 6, 1. Remainder is 1. If you divide 8 by 3, 2s are 6, 2. Remainder is 2. If you divide 9 by 3, 3, 3s are 9, 0. R is equal to 0. If you divide 10 by 3, 3, 3s are 9, 1. So the remainder is 1. So, as per the equation, we are to find the sequence of natural numbers, leaving remainder 1 on division by 3, and sequence of natural numbers, leaving remainder 2 on division by 3. So, first let us sort the natural numbers, leaving remainder 1 on division by 3, and sequence of natural numbers, leaving remainder 2 on division by 3. First of all, let's look for natural numbers leaving remainder 1 on division by 3. So, 1 gives remainder 1 on division by 3. 4 gives remainder 1 on division by 3. 7 gives remainder 1 on division by 3. 10 gives remainder 1 on division by 3. So, sequence of natural numbers leaving remainder 1 is equal to 1 comma 4 comma 7 comma 10. Now let us find the sequence of natural numbers re leaving remainder 2. So, 2 gives remainder 2 on division by 3. 5 gives remainder 2 on division by 3. 8 gives remainder 2 on division by 3. So, sequence of natural numbers leaving remainder is equal to 2 comma 5 comma 8 so this is the answer for the third question I hope you have understood here's the fourth question write down the sequence of natural numbers ending in 1 or 6 and describe it in two other ways First of all, let's write the sequence of natural numbers ending in 1 or 6. First natural number ending in 1 is 1 itself. Then comes 6. After this, the natural number ending with 1 is 11. After this, the natural number ending with 6 is 16. And 21, 
26, 31, 36 and so on. We are to describe this sequence in two ways. If you divide the terms of the sequence by 5, you will get a constant reminder. So this is the one way to describe the sequence. 1 by 5, comma 6 by 5, 11 by 5, comma 16 by 5, 21 by 5. If you check the reminder, the reminder will be 1 in every case. 1 divided by 5, 0 times 0, 1. 6 divided by 5, 1. Reminder is 1. So this is the one method to describe the sequence. That is sequence leaving remainder 1 on division by 5. The another method to represent the sequence is if you check the difference between the terms. That is 6 minus 1, 5. 11 minus 6, 5. If you check the differences or the gaps, you can see that they have a difference of 5. So this sequence is got by adding. 5 to 1 repeatedly. So another method to describe the sequence is sequence got by adding 5 repeatedly to 1. A tank contains 1000 liters of water and it flows out at the rate of 5 liters per second. How much water is there in the tank after each second? Write the numbers as a sequence. First of all, the water in the tank initially is equal to 1000 liters. Water in the tank initially is equal to 1000 liters. After each second, 5 liters of water goes out. So, water in the tank after 1 second is equal to 1000 minus 5, which is equal to 995 liters. Water In the tank, after two seconds, water in the tank after two seconds is equal to 995 minus 5, which is equal to 990 liters. Water in the tank after 3 seconds is equal to 990 minus 5 which is equal to 985 liters so after each five after each second 5 liters of water goes out so finally the sequence obtained before Sequence obtained is at the beginning we had thousand liters, thousand comma nine ninety five, nine ninety, nine eighty five, and so on. So this is the answer for the fifth question. This is all about exercise. In the page number 10 and 11. Thank you for watching. Do 
like and share this video and subscribe to my channel and PDF for notes is given in the description box and do join my telegram